All right, gather up your friends, family, and coworkers. It's almost time for the Tales on the Trail Dog Walk. The fun family event is happening at Veterans Park on Milwaukee's lakefront. The 5K run and a one-mile walk benefits all the four-legged friends who need help in our community. I think I recognize the little boy in that picture right there. I think that's Kim, our executive producer's Aww. son, Carson. Aww. That's so cool. And Jill DeGrave is here from the Wisconsin Humane Society with all the details, and she brought along a sweet little puppy who needs a place to call home. And I love his name. It is Shorty. 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 Isn't that darling? Oh, oh, he dude. is such an adorable puppy. He's only eight weeks old and he is a beagle mix. And Aww. of course, he's been neutered and microchipped and initial vaccinations. He's all set to go. He and he's got is. a lot of energy this morning. I can tell. How but big is so Shorty going to get? Will he always be Shorty? He'll be, he probably will be <laughs> medium sized tops okay. uh, because his breed mix is a smaller breed and he uh, he's a but he's only eight weeks so he does have a little growing oh, to do. Is oh, isn't he so cute? cute? I know. I love cutie. this guy. I saw the cutest sign over the weekend when I was out shopping and said my favorite dog breed is rescued. Oh, oh isn't that nice? Really I know. Yeah, and that's I thought awesome. about all the, the pooches that you bring our way. Let's talk a little bit about tails on the trail. This is a fun event because it's a 5K run and a one-mile one mile walk. walk. Correct. Right? It's June 14th. Uh, that's a Sunday morning at Veterans Park on the lakefront. And you know how gorgeous our mm. lakefront is, especially on a summer morning. What a fun event this is. And it's great for the whole family. In fact, each person can bring up to two dogs oh. with them. But you don't have to have a dog. You know, some dogs get a little overwhelmed at that kind yeah. of activity. Mm -hmm. If your dog is one that might not enjoy it, come anyway. It benefits all the homeless animals that we serve at the Wisconsin Humane Society. And if you don't have a dog at all, that's, I mean, that's totally fine. If you want to participate in the 5, 5K, can you jog with your dog? Yes, you can. You can. So, but if your dog is not really into, like, the major exercise, then you can also just walk with your Correct. dog. Correct. And I think you need to be aware of that before you start running. Mm -hmm. They have to work into it. When there are events that, that where you invite people's pets like that, are there certain rules that people should follow? Like, for example, I'm sure you should be up to date with your vaccinations, Correct. right? And your dog should be social with mm -hmm. people and other dogs. And we're asking that you not not have a retractable leash where oh. they go way okay. out and okay. they can, you know, your dog needs to stay next to you and be respectful of other dogs mm -hmm. um, during the walk or the run. So, but what a great event. We have um, activities, games for people and dogs. We have food trucks. We have tons of exhibitors and vendors. Um, a lot of fun stuff. An allure course where your dog chases an object and it's a timed event and just fun stuff for the whole family. Wow, Cute. that's cool. So your dog can actually participate. It's not just watching professional dogs doing Correct. professional <laughs> things. And we have some new things this year, an agility course. Again, your dog can participate. Uh, a caricature artist. We have uh, at 11 o'clock live music. Oh, that's hey, cool. I know, that'll be cool. And drum Fun. roll, beer. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> you know, so, it's, it's wonderful. I think that it's a fun, it, it, it brings people out. They have does. fun. I mean, even I think about your tasting for um, oh, Fido the events. Fido I mean, there's Felix. wine and there's beer. It's people just fun. have a grand time. They do, and you're socializing with people who are interested in the same thing you are, and that is helping these awesome animals. Yeah, and I would think the, there's a, the importance of events like this for, for mm -hmm. what you do. It really does. It really helps support uh, our mission and all of our good work in the community on behalf of, of these awesome animals like Shorty. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, if somebody just wants to make a donation, they could do that as well, right? They don't have to necessarily, maybe they're going to be out of town, they can't participate. Oh, they totally can. In fact, if you make a donation by June 1st, uh, Stan Cass, uh, a donor of ours and his dog Reggie, who he got from us, and the Glazner Family Foundation will match donations up to ten thousand dollars. So wow. now's the time to make those before up until June first. Yes, but you can make them after as well. So you okay. double so, any gift yeah. that you give right now. Yeah, that's, so that's, that's great. really cool. That's like true giving power. It is. I like that. Okay, so for people to sign up for the five K race or the one mile walk, um, or to find out more about Shorty, is it still wihumane.org? They find out about the event as well as adopting Exactly, a or 414 Animals. Okay, and when will Shorty be available? Shorty will be available today at noon. Okay. <laughs> oh. I think you might have a line. He's I know, so cute. Isn't he adorable? Here's the information so that you can find out more about this wonderful event. It is Tales on the Trail. It's a dog walk as well as a 5K run. Go to wihumane.org or call 414 Animals. They're located on West Wisconsin Avenue in Milwaukee. Always great to see you, Joe. Great to see Thank you. you. Thank so you so much.